just like to send out my thoughts and prayers to Jacob Blake and his family, another young black man shot by a police officer. Um, we need to have change. We need to be better. Um, and I'm hoping for the best for him and his family. I'm hoping for the best as we uh, work through this in Wisconsin and Milwaukee and in Kenosha. So thoughts and prayers with Jacob Blake. I wanted to know how, if you've had a chance to discuss this with the team yet, and you know maybe some of your objectives when you, you do broach this topic with the team and what those conversations are like and what you hope to gain from them. We have not broached the subject as a team, um, you know, since you know, I, I think the, the shooting occurred sometime, you know, early evening last night. And um, but I can tell you it's on our players mind. It's on our coaches mind. It's on our staff's mind. It's on our organization's mind. And um, certainly a lot of respect for um, we have a playoff game that's very important to us. But um, an incident like this is more important than anything we're doing in Orlando. And I think there was a lot of talk before we came here that we needed to continue this conversation. We needed to be better as a country and um, have no more of these incidents and um, understand that black lives matter. And uh, so I think um, maybe not between now and the game, but um, sometime soon, you know, as a team, um, we can sit and discuss and share and. Uh, just continue to push forward and try and find progress and find try and find systemic change um, that's lasting. Um, so, you know, as we said before we came, and a lot of people have said it, you know, very, very often, it's it's much more important than anything we're doing today in our game and than we're doing in Orlando. Um, and this is just another reminder that's very sad and very unfortunate. And, um, but hopefully we can find progress out of all this. Sports fans, if you want to see more videos like this, check out some of our other ones right here. And if you like what you see, make sure to hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more from USA Today Sports.